Hello, my name is Justin Perkins, a current soldier in the United States Army, and also a current graduate student in the Information Engineering Management Program here at the University of Alabama, Birmingham. Uh, this program has indeed been a blessing to me and has cultivated and shown me various ways to manifest my dreams and desires that I have that I never knew were possible. Uh, to me, uh, entrepreneurship has always been viewed as a high risk uh, or willingness to put yourself on the line, your finances, your time, uh, all for an uncertain venture. Uh, this uncertainty is in fact a deterrent for many people as it was for me to even uh, pursue entrepreneurial uh, endeavors. Uh, I was once that person, uh, full of ideas, creative notions, uh, full of, of potential, uh, but never truly possessing the tools needed to uh, encourage me to try. So when I joined the IEM program, I had very little intentions of exiting my comfort zone of familiarity. As a United States soldier, I was okay with the stability that that my career provided and the security that it ensued. Um, I began using the expression phrase, uh, catchphrase, bless it, as you can see uh, behind me, late 2014, early 2000, part of 15. And uh, originally it was just a simple expression of truth. Uh, I used it in casual conversation as an affirmation or acknowledgement of good and uh, just in simple conversation. But the catchphrase quickly caught fire uh, in my social network. Um, circle of friends and network uh, communities. And as the recognition grew, uh, the rapid growth of the catchphrase seemed to catch fire. Um, I was inspired to manifest my abstract and, uh, and, and create something concrete to bring that idea to life. Um, so the blessed catchphrase, uh, as you can see on the logo behind me, really became the, became the brand signature look. I started with uh, one black blessed t-shirt with the uh, white blessed logo embolized on it and this became the brand signature look um, for that time. After council I was inspired to pursue legitimizing my business and legitimizing my ideas through trademark and uh, official brandings of, of my business and today blessed currently produces clothing for men, women and children uh, for summer, spring, and uh, fall, winter and fall seasons. And so um, the IEM program is very inspirational in me taking my ideas and, and, and trusting what the program provided me in order to manifest and create uh, something tangible. Uh, it was the IEM program that sparked my entrepreneurial flame more so than anything. Uh, courses like Mr. West Conwell's 631 class provided me with the tools to manage and execute my entrepreneurial ideas. And I, and I took things like big data tools and uh, technologies and use that in order to manage uh, production and uh, financial results from marketing and things that were taking place in my business. Um, Dale's technology and innovation course showed me ways to innovative and apply creativity to my business and taking cheap input and, and way, showing ways that I could take cheap input and although it was less expensive, create a quality product on the output end. Um, using technology and innovation to make my business better. Um, and lastly, financial concepts uh, from the IEM 645 course was probably the most impactful because it took, it, it took uh, my ideas and showed me ways of making financially feasible. Um, some things and ideas that I had at the time were, were uh, overbur overbearing or a burden on my finances um, personally and in the business sense, but uh, through the financial concept of course I was able to uh, grasp a hold to some key concepts to, to make my business profitable and be able to balance income to expenses. So these concepts were just a few of the theories um, that the program provided that were, that were once just lectures in a classroom or words from a book but this program gave me the opportunity to uh, take those words and manifest them into reality and today I'm a current entrepreneur. Thanks to IEM. Bless it.